Hi there, Susie here, and I'm very glad you can join me again in this video. In a few moments, we will talk about natural dog skin cancer home remedies and how you can correctly use them to support your canine family member during this disease. Before we start our discussion, I'd just like to invite you to click on the subscribe button so you can easily get access to all of my videos. And if you haven't done so already, please hit the bell icon while you're at it so you will get an instant notification as soon as I have a new video up. I've got lots of content about keeping your dog as healthy and happy as can be using natural means and I don't want you to miss out on any of them. So this might not be the first video you have seen on my channel. Uh, I am an advocate of holistic solutions and a practitioner of homeopathic medicine for close to a decade now. My team and I at Homeo Animal are committed to showing pet parents around the world that nature's medicine cabinet also has several awesome offerings for our pets. Besides promoting ideal immune system health, these natural products can also be used to properly give your dog the support he needs in times of illness so your canine family member won't be an easy target for diseases, especially cancer. As a pet parent myself, I know how devastating it is to learn that your dog has skin cancer. It's one of the most heartbreaking things to hear. Now, while skin cancer in dogs may be a very serious condition, it doesn't mean that all hope is already lost. There are actually natural dog skin cancer home remedies that you can go for in terms of supporting your canine friend during this illness. But before we discuss what these home remedies are, let's first talk about the different types of skin cancer in dogs. There are actually several types of skin cancer in dogs. However, we will just focus on the three most common types in our discussion. So those three types will be malignant, melanoma, squamous cell carcinoma, and mast cell tumor. I will explain each one in more detail in a bit. Let's start with malignant melanoma. Malignant melanoma is characterized by raised bumps around a dog's nail beds, mouth, and lips. This type of skin cancer typically attacks cells called melanocytes that contain melanin, which is a natural skin pigment. While any dog breed can be at risk of malignant melanoma, Scottish Terriers and Schnauzers are considered to be more prone to this disease. Additionally, male dogs are more vulnerable to this type of skin cancer. Next up is squamous cell carcinoma. Squamous cell carcinoma affects the outermost or top layer of a dog's skin. This type of skin cancer is in dogs usually produces firm, fuzzy patches on the abdomen, lower legs, foot pads, and head. This type of dog skin cancer growth is more prevalent in basset hounds, standard poodles, dalmatians, as well as bull terriers that are most lightly white in color. Finally, we have the mast cell tumor. This type of skin cancer in dogs attacks immune system cells called mast cells. Although a mast cell tumor can manifest anywhere on a dog's body, it can be usually found in and around the chest, the lower abdomen, and limbs. Golden Retrievers, Boston Terriers, and Boxers are said to be the most vulnerable to mast cell tumors. Now we've got that covered, let's talk about the symptoms of dog skin cancer. Skin cancer in dogs is typically characterized by unexplained bumps, warts, and masses on a dog's body. Its manifestations can also take on the form of lesions or rubbery bulges that can be gray, dark brown, or pink in color. And in addition to these, your dog can also show physical and movement difficulties such as limping or having trouble opening and closing his mouth, like in the case of uh, malignant melanoma. Chronic bad breath can also be an indicator of dog skin cancer. But before we move on to the next part of this video, let me just ask you a very quick question. How do you like to cuddle your dog? You see, detecting unexplained bumps, lumps, masses on your canine family member's body is as easy as spending a few minutes cuddling with him. You can also do this while you dry him off uh, with a towel after a bath and make sure you keep an eye out on the usual indicators of dog skin cancer because early detection plays a crucial role in successfully getting rid of this disease. 
please feel free to leave your answers in the comments section. I am so excited to check out your responses very soon. Let's now move on to the causes of skin cancer in dogs. Believe it or not, there still isn't a single major cause of dog cancer that has been determined by scientists and medical experts. However, there are several possible factors that could trigger the onset of this disease. These factors include old age, genetics, prolonged exposure to the sun, harmful chemicals in the environment, as well as sudden abnormalities in the hormones. This is the biggest reason why it is extremely important to boost your dog's immune system so he won't be an easy target for diseases, especially against cancer. Now, let's jump right into the part you've been waiting for. Here are the dog skin cancer home remedies you need to have on your checklist to not just help ward off this disease, but also provide the right support should your dog be afflicted with this illness. But before I continue, i just like to point out that the other home remedies against dog skin cancer that I will be sharing came from what we have gathered online from our research. So without further ado, let's get right to it. First on our list of dog skin cancer home remedies is turmeric. Turmeric is a relative of ginger and is mainly grown throughout Asia as a key ingredient in curry dishes. According to scientific research, turmeric contains a substance called curcumin that has been seen to help eliminate cancer cells and intercept them from spreading to other parts of the body. You can use turmeric as a dog cancer holistic treatment either fresh or in dry powder form. You can mix in about two pinches of fresh turmeric directly into your dog's meal. And don't forget to peel the whole thing first since the skin can be a bit fibrous and hard to digest. You can also grate the turmeric to help eliminate the stringy bits. On the other hand, you can mix the dry powdered turmeric into your dog's water bowl to harness its curcumin content. A fourth of a teaspoon will do the trick. You can also mix powdered turmeric with a bit of coconut oil to make a salve to apply on the affected area of the skin. Second on our checklist of dog cancer natural remedies is lychee. Although mostly known worldwide as a tropical fruit that adds another dimension of flavor to fruit salads, lychee or lychee has also been observed to have cancer repelling properties. Scientific studies show that lychee contains compounds that can block the proliferation of cancer cells and even stimulate cancer cell death. And integrating lychee into your dog's regular diet can help ward off skin cancer in dogs. However, it is important to remember that you should remove the skin in the pit before feeding it to your dog. Depending on the size of your dog, a maximum of two lychees should be enough. Now let me introduce you to a natural and high quality option that you can go for alongside other conventional treatments or by itself for dog skin home remedies, the Piptopad. It is made from a mushroom called Piptoporus betalinus or more newly referred to Fomitopsis betalina. It is natural and has been made with the highest standards of holistic medicinal approach. It basically works by promoting a healthy immune system as well as providing the right amount of support during cancer. And what makes PiptoPet even more versatile is that this natural product can also be used in addition to more traditional treatments such as chemotherapy. If we're being honest, skin cancer in dogs is a very serious disease. And supporting your dog during this illness is not just about choosing a canine skin cancer home remedy. It's about choosing the best natural option that doesn't just help maintain your dog's good health, but will also give him the right support during cancer. I want to make sure you give your dog the care and support he truly deserves. If you want to find out more about PiptoPet, check out the link that is on your screen right now. You can also browse the description box of this video for the link. So that pretty much wraps up our video on natural dog skin cancer home remedies. If you're looking to find out more about dog skin cancer home remedies, make sure you check out our six natural ways to help your dog during cancer. Whether you want to expand your knowledge on how to keep your dog clear from skin cancer or provide the proper support during this disease, this free guide will definitely give you access to all the useful information you need. You just have to click on the link that will appear on the screen right about now to start exploring our six natural ways to help your dog during cancer or check out the description 
uh, box of this video for the same. Don't forget to hit the like button if you learned something from this video. You can also leave a comment if you have a question or have some additional insights to share. And if you haven't done so already, remember to click on subscribe so you won't miss out on any of my videos that are focused on keeping your pet as healthy and happy as can be through natural means. Now make sure you watch next 10 things to help your dog feel better during cancer to find out more about how you can really give your canine friend the love and care he needs should he be afflicted with this disease. See you again soon in my next video.